There's something that the world does not know about Jamaica and Jamaicans. We see them as a happy party people. Jamaica, no problem. But Jamaicans know how to hide their pain. There are children who are on the streets. There's a lot of teenage pregnancies. There is not enough food, not enough money for school, not enough model parents to help them to grow up to be all they can be. Now when I came to Maypan, I recognized that there were so many kids that were in need. I saw myself on the streets. And so I decided, my husband and I decided, we say, we're gonna to try to do something. But in doing something, we had no other place. We would have to take them home. I guess we have grown over 32 kids passing through our homes right now. We sent them to school, we bathed them, we washed them, and we took them in, and we took care of them. How we do it is we take you home unconditionally. We don't need to know you. We don't need to know where you're from. We just know that the love in our heart and the fact that they are fearfully and wonderfully made is a reason to help another child. There was a young lady who was involved in trafficking drugs and she was deported from the United States. And she came home pregnant and had no place to go. I took them in. That young lady is now working with the government of Jamaica as a phlebotomist. Her children have just graduated from high school. That's powerful for me. And it was not in an institution. They came out of my home. If you're abused, if you're molested, if you've been taken advantage of, you can be all that you can be. And say it with all confidence. When a young man in a wheelchair who could not read because he dropped out of school now runs my office because we teach him to read, I do it because there is a need. I do it because I see myself in them. I do it because I know that if they get the opportunity to shine, they will be diamonds in the sky. I'm not paid to do this. I don't get a financial reward. But when I see someone all dressed up, walking out there with their shoulders high and their head lifted and the smiles on their faces, and they come back to me and say, Mom, guess what? I got a job, or you know what? I just graduated with a degree. Those things just make me feel like, wow, I am excited. I am filled up with joy. I am happy. I am just so elated. I want to do more. So who is next? That's where I am. That's, that's where I go. Who is next? <laughs>